Hi, this is Mike Bradford with BillyCommunity.com. I'm here with Tony Palma, the director of Nine Ball, the movie, which is going to be coming out soon. Uh, Tony, can you tell us a little bit about what's the uh, production status on the film? Absolutely. Uh, we are going back into production uh, mid-April, and uh, we're going to be shooting down in the Glen Burnie area of Maryland, and we're going to be shooting uh, most of all of the pool scenes, so we're really excited about that. Uh, we'll be shooting in the Glen Burnie area for uh, at least a week, and um, uh, then we will be wrapping down there and coming back up here to Philadelphia to uh, uh, continue production. Great. How long is production time typically on a film like this? Well, production time uh, can be anywhere from uh, six months to a year, depending on uh, how many scenes, the uh, pre-production that's involved in each scene, so it can really vary. Great, great. And um, when do you expect the uh, film to be released? Uh, we're anticipating, if everything goes according to schedule, to uh, be looking at a release date of uh, early to mid-summer. Great, great. Well, I know a lot of people are really excited about the film, looking forward to it. And um, what do you hope to gain uh, as far as pool is concerned for, expo for getting a movie like this and, ex and having a pool exposed to a wider audience? What are your goals in creating the movie? Well, I think that this movie is going to really be uh, a wonderful thing for pool in general. The story is, uh, as you probably know, about a young woman, so it's, a, it's got a unique twist right there. Uh, about a young woman who was aspiring initially to become a, uh, a professional player and all the hurdles that she has to overcome in her right. life in order to become a professional. And then uh, I'll, I'll let the cat out of the bag a little bit for you. Uh, our, our intentions are once we finish with this film and Gail who, of course, is played by Jennifer Beretta, becomes a professional. Mm -hmm. Then we're planning to do a sequel that will follow Jennifer on her quest to become the world champion. Great, great. So uh, this movie is very unusual for many reasons. Uh, first of all, it's the first movie ever. Uh, the first movie ever that has to do with uh, focusing in on women in pool. Uh, this movie, unlike a lot of previous pool movies, uh, is focusing in on the positive aspects of pool. So, Excellent. That's so, great. So this is not a movie that people are going to look at and they're going to think, oh, you know, it's another pool movie with guys beating each other over the head with pool cues. Right, right. Uh, in back rooms, you know, uh, no, this, this is a story really about um, uh, what it really takes to, first of all, become a professional, uh, and then what it takes to, once you are a professional, to become a champion. So, I mean, this movie is really going to show to the world, uh, and I think uh, our, our pool fans uh, worldwide are going to love it, uh, as well as our general audience, uh, to see a great movie with the story is really what I would call uh, an insp inspirational story. I, I, I think that uh, a, a lot of people will feel at the end of this uh, this movie, where they're gonna they're gonna say to themselves, "Gee, I I, I, I wish I had, you know, or you know, I wish I had a little bit more of, you know, that the the those right. wonderful characteristics yes. of that character Gail. Right. I wish I had some more of that in me, you know, to really help me overcome, you know, my hurdles. Maybe I, maybe I'll." You know, maybe it'll be inspirational and, and yeah. really and inspiring. Well, it's great that uh, you're incorporating things like the APA and, and that type of uh, environment as opposed to movies of the past, where which have all been about gambling and tournament play and you know success and fame have sort of been secondary and almost um, you know, for example, the color of money, you know, not really the main focus, not really the driving force. Well, you mentioned Jennifer Beretta. What other uh, 
famous faces from pool can we expect to see in the movie? Well, uh, I can tell you that uh, we, we just uh, started communication uh, with uh, one of the most uh, famous uh, women players in the world. Of course, we have Jeanette Lee, who's already in the movie, uh, which I'm sure a lot of our uh, fans are going to be very excited to see Jeanette. Absolutely. Uh, but we just started communication. I don't want to leak out anything prematurely, but I will tell, I will tell you that uh, uh, this uh, woman pool player is uh, top, one of the top players in the world, uh, and uh, if everything goes according to uh, our plan, she will be uh, bringing her worldwide uh, fans great. into the movie as well. That's great. Well, I've really enjoyed your time. Thank you very much, and good luck on the movie. Thank you very much. Great. Always, always a pleasure to work with Bill and your community. Thank you, sir. You're welcome.